if your compound is basic in nature it must be amine and the test that we perform is functional group test for presence of tertiary secondary or primary amine hello students i am aparna kulkarni and in this video i will explain how to perform azo dye test for aromatic amines let's first see what are amines amines are the organic compounds derived from ammonia they are derived by replacing one or more hydrogen atoms by alkyl or aryl group for example if one hydrogen is uh, replaced by alkyl group we call it as primary amine if two hydrogen atoms are replaced we call it as secondary amine and if three hydrogens are re replaced by alkyl or aryl group we call it as tertiary amine when one hydrogen atom of ammonia is replaced by phenyl or aryl group the compound obtained is primary aromatic amine in this video we will discuss azo dye test for testing such compounds means aromatic primary amine for this the chemicals that we will need are hydrochloric acid table reagent of course then sodium nitride and beta naphthol in naoh the apparatus required are test tube and pasteur pipette for testing i am taking aniline structure of aniline is shown so as you can see it contains functional group nh2 means it is primary amine so let's start with the test uh we have to take substance uh, to be tested in dry test tube i have taken aniline and i have added around 5 ml hcl substance uh, dissolves in hcl uh, as it is basic in nature uh, students make mistake of adding small quantities of hcl remember to add sufficient quantity of hcl so that substance will dissolve now to this we have to add one two drops of nno2 using pasteur pipette again here common mistake is adding large quantity of nno2 don't make that mistake otherwise that will spoil your test after adding nno2 uh, shake and observe color uh at this point if substance is tertiary amine you will observe red coloration if substance is secondary amine you will observe yellow oil or ppt but as you can see in this case we have obtained clear solution so to check presence of primary amine we will pour this solution to beta naphthol in naoh uh for this uh take beta naphthol in naoh in another test tube and now pour the clear solution obtained earlier means substance plus hcl plus nno2 to this beta naphthol in naoh and we have to observe the color uh as you can see in this case we have obtained uh, orange red uh, dye formation of orange red dye confirms presence of aromatic primary amine now you should able to answer why orange dye is obtained when primary aromatic compound is present uh primary aromatic amines on treatment with nno2 and hcl forms diazonium salt this diazonium salt coupled with beta naphthol to form azo compound which is orange red in color so with this we conclude the test in next video we'll perform test for secondary and